Hi guys, Jess Rock back again in Man of War Corsair. Now, as you can see, we're an hour now. Um, I've had some problems getting this recording done. This will be my third or fourth attempt, I think. Um, so just a quick little rundown. Um, the mission, where is it? Uh, notice board. They stole my sword. Now, I've attempted this one each time. Now, what has also happened, there's been an update. Um, I've been playing on the Unstable branch. Um... Another update's come through. This one relating to melee combat. Basically, if you board or get boarded, what you can do now is press tab and it will lock onto a target. Um, walk backwards and press tab to unlock. What is it? Oh, finally. If you hold down shift while you're moving, you'll run, which is that time. Um, otherwise, like you've got more of a chance of parrying. Um, your crewman won't walk into you and then just stagger around like they're useless. Um, yeah, I think that's about it for that initial part of it. Um, the way we found this out, there was a, while I was off to try and do this particular mission, an orc ship waylaid us and boarded us. You couldn't sink it. Um, wow, I'm arming lots. My bad. Anyway, I haven't had a look to complete the quest. They stole my sword since then. What I'm going to do is, before we accept this quest... Uh, I've already spoken very briefly with uh, the... Oh, I sent a message through anyway, seeing if they knew if this quest was bugged or not, uh, through to the dev te the, the Twitter team for Man of War Corsair. And I'm going to give it one last try. If this doesn't work, I'll be sending my save file through to them and we'll just skip this quest. But what I'm going to do is stop the recording here and pick it straight back up again. If the quest works... Wonderful, we'll just continue from there. If it doesn't, then obviously I'll just cut that chunk out. We'll come back, and we'll pick up from roughly this point. I hope any of that made sense. Our local two days of winter are very much over, so it's straight back into summer, and i am basically got my, ba bleh, got my brain baking in this weather, so not good at humaning. Back in the tick. Okay, well, back now. Let's try and see if we can do this quest. The tavern is as taverns are, all smoke and stale beer. As your crew scatter seeking comfort and company within, your gaze is drawn to an old cove deep in his cups in the corner of the room. Almost instinctively, he raises his head and returns your gaze. His eyes take the measure of you, and content with what he sees, he gestures for you to join him. Ah, uh, you the look of a lad who's seen a fair share of trouble. If you have the time, I have a tale that could put gold in that meagre purse you're carrying. Despite his bedraggled look, the man has steel in his eyes and strength in his hands, his bearing that of a man suited to command. However, the inkings of a kraken wrapped tight around his forearm indicate a less than amiable nature. Let me tell you, boy, this hand has held the finest steel fires forged, a unique blade burning with a molten heart whose flames cut down all before me. It was torn from me by mutinous dogs who coveted its magical strength. I was cast from the ship and left to wallow in this here port. A man of my history needs to be circumspect in Empire waters, and at present I find myself impoverished in impoverished circumstances. However, my word is true, and gold will be yours if you are willing to recover my property from those treacherous curs. Flay them alive for all I care, just bring me back that sword. I'll see to it that your sword is returned, for fair compensation. Good to hear it. Those craven fools are probably sailing off the coast near Wreckers Point right now, Seeking new ventures to profit from. Stand by your word and I'll hold to mine. Okay, now... Undock. One other thing. Uh, bear with me a tick. I need to fix volume of fraction. Okay, that's a bit better. Now, is it recording over the top? No, okay. Give me a quick moment, peeps seem that the wizard is freaking noisy and down a bit more uh, oh yeah that should do the trick let's just take a look at our options they have changed uh, a little bit with the wizards as well well actually no they may not have changed it i may just not have noticed it before to be quite brutally honest one menu that I have never really taken advantage of since they've started really using it. 
you go into map, click on crew, and you can see your wizard. In this case, we've got Heinrich. Now, it'll start off looking like that. Cast spells automatically. Now, with Wind Blast, that's the one that pushes the enemy ships away and all that sort of stuff. The way I found this was because I had my brain getting fried, so I kept chasing a ship, and the wizard kept just pushing it away. But yeah, anyway, so just that off. Now, where are we going to go? Up here. Pity I didn't explain that bit before I started recording. If this goes awry, I'm going to have to explain it all over again. Uh, he knows. Okay. Basically, I'll sort of explain it now. I'll be coming upon a bunch of pirate ships up here. Uh, one of them... I think it's three small ones and one slightly bigger one, a wolf ship by memory. Theoretically, the sword's on the wolf ship, and we've got to board it. Can't sink it, we've got to board it, which has been where the era, era, era has been. Um, it's prevented me, no matter what I've done, it's prevented me from physically boarding the wolf ship. Look at the wizard all casty and stuff. Another thing I'm spewing about, one of the recordings that just went awry, I ended up getting attacked by a Wyvern, which is kind of cool. Ended up taking it out with cannons. Now, theoretically, the ships should be heading this way-ish. Really hope this works, because, yeah, I want to do this mission. We've done a mission with the Ice Sword, which is what we're now wielding. We've done a mission with... There we go. We've done a mission with the... Lightning Hammer. And now we're going after a Flame Sword. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, a couple of smaller ones. Looks like there's a large convoy over there, Captain. They must be the ships you spoke of. No, and pirates, the sword has probably made it to the hands of whoever commands that wolf ship in the middle of the convoy. The I think we should get in and board them, take the sword and run for it. Which is exactly what we're going to try and do. Yeah, no. Won't let me board them. Board, board, board. Nope. Okay, so what I'm going to try and do... See if we can survive taking out the little ships. Turn around, you ball bag of a ship. Okay, maybe pirates, but if it sinks, so does the sword. Don't. Oh, really? Really? Come on, wind. Don't be such a douche canoe. Okay. The only other thing I can do is think to do is damage the ship enough that. They surrender. And then try and border. But obviously there's no guarantee that I'll be able to damage enough that they surrender. And not just sink it. Oh great, now that orcs coming up on us too. So. Come on. I hear a flyer. What do we got? Pegasus. Okay. Ow. 
I really don't want to have to fight orcs as well. Oh crap. Stupid wind. Ah, there we go. About time. Now let's see if we can survive this. Turn around, you ball bag. Come on. Ow. Another thing that's kind of good too, I've noticed um, since the last little update bit, I don't seem to fly up into the air randomly every time I walk over something. Okay. How many of my crew have I lost? None. Lovely. What else we got? A few more here. Get them dead. Get them dead. Come on. One. Sword is in our hands, Captain. Ain't often one gets to see steel of such beauty. Tis a shame we have to hand the blade back to the man the likes of him. No, it's not a shame. We're giving it back because we're nice people. Yay! The quest worked. I only, only had to let my ship get munted up. Hmm. Come on, let's speed things up a bit and get out of the wind. Now, I didn't give the... Uh, in our last... In our last playthrough, we did get ourselves a wolf ship in one episode, but literally, I think I kept it for about 10 minutes and then swapped it out. Might give it a bit more of a try this time around, I don't know. The ability to move in whatever damn direction we want, well, forwards and backwards, regardless of the wind, would be rather nice, even if it's not at a huge speed. So we lost one crewman during that. I don't know what the hell was happening then. Come on, just sink him and be done with it. Down she goes. Uh, which way are we going to go? Back to Aranel. And we managed to avoid the enemy fleets. Barely. Even better. Sorry, coffee was miles away. Check out Heinrich there, just doing his little hula dance thing. Okay. Um. Actually, while we're here. Is it in our... Sw yeah, there it is. Check it out. Can't really get any info on it, but... 
a flaming sword. Red magical sword infused with the red wind of Akshi. Akshi, I am. That burns into flames when drawn. Bursts into flames when drawn. Yeah, I think I like my ice blade more. I don't know what it is in a lot of games, actually. Everyone's always like, oh yeah, go the fire dam. I've always gone for the ice damage, preferably. Yeah. Ah, you've returned. Is that my blade I spy? It's good to know those curs have been shown their place. Gold or blood boy, what'll it be? No man here can deny my rightful claim. Okay, a deal's a deal. Man of his word, here's your gold. I hope to find you... Yeah, I hope you find the sum rather fetching. If there's ever any further issues that arise, I'll seek, seek your employee again. <laughs> See, that's part of the reason why... I do go for the give them back the item or any of that. I've played too many games where as long as you don't screw them over, then they become characters that you can use more often later. 5,000 gold crowns. Whether or not that happens in this, I don't know, but that's sort of just how I play, I guess. I may be a pirate, but I don't have to be dishonest about it. Or something. Okay. I don't have a lot of gold. What have we got on the notice board? Flyer hunt and a ship hunt. Well, we know what a ship hunt is, so we'll grab that. Flyer hunt. I would keep an eye on the skies if I were you. Oven has been preying on ships and their claws around these waters. When their crews around these quarters. If you're ringing the beast head into port, he'll be well rewarded. Captain, the wyvern has been sighted. Let's go and take out this here Wyvern. Right there. Hello, buddy. Now, this is... Yeah, you can't seem to aim down with these guys. I don't know what the dealio is. So we are getting further away from that Wyvern, so let's get ourselves back to it. Ah, which one am I... What the hell? We have the weather gate, yeah. Um, Somehow it appears I've clicked off screen or something. Bear with me while I try and get this working again. Oh, I'm gonna stop the recording there. I'll be back. Okay, guys, we're gonna try that again. We'll take an assassination because yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause okay, we'll try the fly hunt. Uh, here at a trouble time, soul survivor of a wrecked trade ship told us attacked by women. Captain, the women has been decided. Okay, what I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna wait because for all I know, that was a cinematic issue. Now we're gonna wait, gonna wait, gonna wait, gonna wait, gonna wait. Maybe. Okay, let's go after it. Oh crap. Let's repair our ship. And then we'll go after it. <laughs> Now it's turning around to come back. Also taking damage. I would like to think it's from our archers and whatnot. Liking to think it and it actually being the case though are two very different things. What the hell is it doing? I 
this will actually again be the third attempt. Um, had the same problem as I did the first time with everybody not doing anything and not being able to get control of my ship again. There seems to be a lot more rigging and stuff now on the um, on this ship. I think I did read it in the patch notes that they were doing that. Purely aesthetic, I assume, for that side of things. And down she goes. Okay, let's go hand in that quest, just so we can get it over and done with. And so that I can re-get the crew member that I had before, that I lost when I reloaded. That I forgot to buy the second time I reloaded, and yeah. Uh, I do want to point out, just in case anyone's looking at my error, like issues with the game and thinking, oh, not only is the game in early access still, like, so you're gonna have to expect some bugs. I'm also playing on the experimental branch, so, and the fact that I have so few problems is amazing. Head of the Wyvern. 500 gold crowns, woo. One thing I did miss, um, until I reloaded that time around, I gained reputation with the pirates for giving that guy back his flame sword. Kind of interesting. Oh crap, I forgot to buy the crewman again. Oh well. 14 will do. But yeah, so, as I said, keep in mind, game's early access, I'm on the unstable branch. And all things considered, the fact that I'm having so little problems is amazing. Like, I haven't played an unstable branch of a game this early in development that hasn't been riddled with issues. And this, in the grand scheme of things, has very few that I've come across. Okay. Now, because we have, I have had to do this recording barely piecemeal. Um, I've sort of lost track of how long the recording's gone for overall. I'm not much sure how much longer this episode will go for. I think I might kill this guy and then go take on that orc fleet. Oh, come on. Catch up and squish it. Squish it. Squish it. I need a faster boat. I just need a bigger boat with chase cannons. We're by the wind. I miss having a boat bristling with cannons everywhere. Oh, seriously, come on, catch up. Of course you're going to go in there. <laughs> but not only will we be dealing with the buccaneer, the crossed blades... We're going to be dealing with Orc Troll Stake. Yep, that's the name of the ship, the Troll Stake. Not into the wind, douche canoe. There it is. It's just a little rammer. See, the Troll Stake. Oh, and it's got cargo. Oh, seriously, hit the damn thing. I miss my long-range cannons. My long-range cannons miss me. And because I have no long-range cannons... I'm missing everything else. Yeah, I couldn't figure out what to rhyme after that bit. My bad. Come on, wind, just turn that little bit more. Or enemy ship, turn that little bit more. Someone turn that little bit more. Just come back and attack me, would be wonderful. We have the weather gauge, Captain. I'm glad we have the weather gauge. The weather gauge needs to come a few more degrees around to the west, though. Where did that little rammer go? Way up there already. It's been zipping around. I 
I don't think I'm in range yet. No, nowhere near. Come on. The advantage is we're faster than it, so we can at least get in front of it. And try and... There we go. We've got a bit of a wind change. Let's try and cut it off. Oh, crap. Okay, troll stakes gone that way. Go bad and crunch. Stand your ground, we're by the wind. Okay. Gotta be within range now, finally. Now with the ones like this, like the whole mission this time around is just to kill the captain. I could complete this mission with my gunner. But I suck at ship to ship shots. That's all on me though. Yes, I'm turning into the wind. You don't have to tell me, so please shut up. Well, yes, we did aggravate them. Where'd the orcs go? Are they ignoring me? Nasty sods. One of the few times I didn't want to be ignored. Slow it down a notch. Nope, 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 missed. Thank you. Okay, I'm nearly done. One thing they have fixed, apparently, as well, um, in what will be the upcoming update, or it might be out by now, I don't know. Apparently, the Orc Hulks, I think it is, the big crunches on the front, when you disable them, they actually disable now. Hey. I see an Orc. You're not the orc, but you might be worth saying hello to. I don't know. I mean, it would be horrible if anything accidentally happened to them. Oh crap, you guys came out of nowhere. They have definitely gotten a lot faster. Well, it seems they have. It's one disabled. Where did the other one go? Oh crap, there. Whoa. Okay. Someone has an orc caster. Damn it. What are you doing, you useless little wizard? Cast bubble! Cast bubble! Hawk magic is always so nifty. Seriously, little wizard, you are useless. Hang on. Through wizards. Why are you not... Uh, you're meant to be protecting our ship. But no. I actually want to board this orc ship because it's got a fair bit of loot on board. I'd rather not lose any of it if I don't have to.
Yeah. Jump on board and cut into pieces. Bye bye, oh captain. Reload is so slow. Now I hope we didn't lose too many then. Ah, no, none. Wonderful. And you've got some loot as well, which we will come and commandeer. Oh, don't even start trying to cast magic, you little tosspot. Gork and Mork were totally kicking our asses and you didn't help. Well, not exactly kicking our asses, but making things unpleasant for us. I think if the weapons reloaded a little bit faster, I mean, it would be a little less realistic, but I mean, I'm fighting orcs and goblins, so... Realistic isn't exactly a primary concern. I will defend you, crewmate. Someone defending me would be lovely right about now. Turn around, you toss. Oh, seriously? Quest completed. I'm guessing somebody else must have sunk that ship. Interesting. Um, right here then. Um, right. I have an invisi ship. Or another way of looking at that is I have x-ray binoculars. I think I like the idea of x-ray binoculars. Yeah. Where do we go to find ourselves some dwarves? I want dwarves, damn it. Um, well, anyway, guys, I'm probably going to finish it off right about here. Um, I'm going to go hand these in, repair my ship, replace my crew. I did lose a second one. <laughs> but, yeah, besides that, not going to do a great deal. I might swap out this... Uh, no. Oh, are you kidding me? You sh... You've got to be kidding me. I've once again lost control of my ship because I went too far one way. How do I get the hell out of this view? Slow it down. Anyway, guys, I'm going to try and fix that up. So for the right now, we're going to get going. This is Jess Drak, and this is Man of War Corsair. Please feel free to hit the buttons of appreciation and whatnot down the bottom, and I'll see you guys hopefully in the next episode. Bye!